In this video, I'm talking about recent research that shows evidence that hearing aids may be able to slow down the progression of cognitive decline. Coming up. Hi guys, Cliff Olson, Doctor of Audiology and founder of Applied Hearing Solutions in Anthem, Arizona. And on this channel, I cover a bunch of hearing related information to help make you a better informed consumer. So if you're into that, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to click the bell to receive a notification every time I post a new video. A little while back, I made a video where I discussed research of the Lancet Commission where they identified hearing loss as being the leading modifiable risk factor for dementia, suggesting that if hearing loss was eliminated in midlife, that the cases of dementia would decrease by 9% later in life. However, recent new evidence from researchers for the SenseCog project has revealed that not only does hearing loss pose an increased risk of dementia, but that treating hearing loss with hearing aids may actually slow down the progression of cognitive decline. In a recent article titled Longitudinal Relationship Between Hearing Aid Use and Cognitive Function in Older Americans, they found that hearing aid use was positively associated with episodic memory scores, decline in episodic memory scores was slower after using hearing aids than before using hearing aids. The SenseCog study was unique in the sense that they tracked over 2,000 individuals over the course of 18 years before getting hearing aids tracking the rate of progression of cognitive decline and then also tracking the rate of cognitive decline after getting hearing aids. Now there are two suspected reasons behind why these hearing aid wearers were able to slow down their rate of cognitive decline and the first one is the cascade hypothesis. This suggests that hearing aids may be able to have a positive impact in other areas in an individual's life that could have an impact on the rate of cognitive decline. This includes the reduction of depression, it includes an increase of social interaction, and even an increase in physical activity. The second is the neurobiological impact, which suggests that hearing aids can reduce this sensory deprivation and allow the brain to function more normally. The researchers ultimately concluded that hearing aids may have a mitigating effect on trajectories of cognitive decline in later life. Providing hearing aids or other rehabilitative services for hearing impairment much earlier in the course of hearing impairment may stem the worldwide rise of dementia. Now there's always going to be critics out there that say of course there's a correlation between hearing loss and dementia. As you get older you have more likelihood of getting both of those things, therefore age is really the factor that impacts this. Now I do respect this argument, in fact it used to be my stance back when I was an audiology student. But since that time there's been a lot more research that has come out showing this link between hearing loss and cognitive decline to the point where it's really becoming hard to just say that it's due to age alone. So if you or someone you know has hearing loss, not only will hearing aids improve your ability to communicate, it may also have the ability to reduce your risk of dementia down the road, keeping you mentally fit for years to come. That's it for this video. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. If you like the video, please share it. And if you want to see other videos just like this one, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'll see you next time.